How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another video. We are on episode 4 already of Ryan's Glory. Today is going to be a lot of gameplay in the episode. We need to ground rivals because I want to play champs by team of the year, which is the 20th of January. And I hope you enjoy. If you do, leave a like and subscribe and a comment and I will see you in the episode. We left off last episode with listing a few things on the transfer market. As you can see, we are just over 40,000 coins with a couple of things still on here. We actually have quite a lot on here. So I'm just going to relist everything. If the stuff does sell, great. If not, I will put it back in the club because as soon as there is an upgrade SPC out, the AT plus. So I will just rinse all of that into there. First things first, we're going to check how the current team looks. Today we are going to make a lot of changes. I'm going to buy some players. We're going to use the players that we packed. So I will see you when I do that. And then we're going to jump straight into rivals. Okay. And we're back. We made a couple changes to the team. Um, no coin spent. I don't really see the point in doing that now. Plus there's still a few players like Solskja and Choro we're going to get from objectives. We put a few chem styles on players. Uh, some that we just had in the club. Um... Wouldn't really recommend putting chem styles on players that you're not going to use for the long term unless you just have them in the club and they are untradeable. We'll just put a Mastro on Mbappe for now, although finish would be better. And yeah, let's get into some Rivals games. I'm hoping to move up to maybe even three divisions now and I'll see you when I find a game. Okay, and our first game of the day, I actually noticed that this guy had an 89 rated team. Low chemistry though, so it'll be interesting to see what he has. <laughs> I, I don't get how someone with a team like this is in Division 9, unless they just started and spent a whole lot of FIFA points. But it's the player, not the team, so let's see what we can do. Nice goal by Jota. Come on, Tenali. Jota, goal. It's quite good, actually. Lovely ball roll. Two Mbappe. Rebound. Goal, 3 0. Okay, half time, it's 3 0. This guy is not very good. Um, he has a couple players in his team who just by themselves are worth more than my whole team. So, yeah, it just goes to show you that the team really isn't important. Um, obviously, you're going to struggle no matter how good you are with a bronze team against a, a team like this, but this guy should have stopped. He shouldn't have spent so many FIFA points if he did. If he didn't, I don't know how he got a team like that for, without spending money and with being so bad. Come on, Joaquin. Cut inside. Cut back. Mbappe. Did not want to be outshadowed by Jota. Nice goal by him. <laughs> Don't know why you're celebrating, bro. You're losing 4-1. Okay, so from now on, we're going to gritty against him. If you celebrate against me, uh, I celebrate against you. That's just how it works. Mbappe with the goal. That's right. Come on, Mbappe. Mbappe through to Trippier on the chest. Lovely goal. Okay, so we end up winning 6-1. Pretty straightforward game. Like I said, this guy's team was great, but he was not. And I'll see you in the next game. Just before we get into the next game, we actually completed a few objectives. So we got a two players pack, small electric players pack, an 81 plus midfielders three pack, and an 83 plus double upgrade pack. So hopefully we can get something good. Nothing in the first one. Okay, now two of the best packs, 81 plus midfielders, hopefully we can pack a promo card, nope, 
Erickson. No, Hoybier. Terrible pack. Okay, and last we have the 83 plus pack. This is quite a decent pack actually, so I'm just hoping for some fodder or something usable. Walk out. Robinson. He was a winter wildcard player in the winter wildcard team one, which is kind of annoying. And Luis Suarez, not bad. Uh, probably not going to use him, but we'll take the fodder. We also have a preview pack, so let's see. One day we'll get something good. Not today though. Just before we put a, a contract on Mbappe, that should be his, his seventh game for the club. So let's just have a quick stat check. <laughs> 21 and 5. Then probably one squad, squad battles game in the middle where I'm pretty sure I scored one, maybe three. But that's an insane record. Let's get into the next game and I'll see you then. Okay, and we're back with another game. Apologies if you can hear a background noise. That is the air conditioner. It is so unbelievably hot in here. I can't live without it. Um, not a bad team. Worse than the last one. Let's go. Mbappe threw on goal. Near post. Goal. Mbappe threw to Joaquin. Finesse. What a goal. Don't know why he brought the keep out there. That was really dumb. But not complaining. I'll take it. Jota straight through. Bringing the keep out again. Chip the keeper. Nope. Ball roll. Mbappe got the ball back. Okay, that was lucky. He's about to quit. You can tell that this guy's either a little kid or doesn't know how to play the game. The fact that he brings the goalkeeper out so much and he's just constantly slide tackling. You're never going to win a, a, a game of FIFA like that. And yeah, I'm very happy about that. Hopefully we can get a few more of those and we can quickly run up the divisions. And I'll see you in the next game. Next team, standard Bundesliga, standard Bundesliga and Prem team. He does have full cam, which kind of makes me think that he knows what he's doing, but you can never tell. Let's see. Jota, goal. Like I thought, this guy is a very decent FIFA player. If we win this, though, we'll be in Division 8, which, besides the better rewards, will just help us get qualified for champs because the, like, 25 or 50 points that you earn in the lower divisions, it just takes forever. Good goal. I uh, am rushing in too much on defense, and I don't know if this guy's got constant pressure on, but his defense is quite aggressive. I mean, if he does, it's going to drain his stamina, but yeah, we've got a game on our hands. Ugh, that is so cheesy, man. I don't know if this guy did it on purpose, but he literally brought on the two same foot centurions that I have. I mean, it's obviously a coincidence, but it's just weird. Lovely skill from Mbappe. Goal. That's an unbelievable ball. No, man. Come on, great tackle, Pellegrini. Yes, what a goal. Come on, Mbappe. What a goal. Okay, hopefully that should be GG's. Um, even though I'm playing against worse players who have worse players... I'm so used to playing on my main account with my super team. I will post a picture of it now. Yeah, it's just, it makes such a difference when you use worse players. You can definitely feel it, but I'm not complaining. I'm having a lot more fun on this account. I actually haven't played on my main account for about a week or two now, so I am absolutely loving doing this, actually. Okay, and we won 4-2. Um, 
Much tougher game, still relatively comfortable. That should put us on, if I'm not mistaken, how many... Is, okay, so we're in Division 8, which is great. And we should almost have the rewards unlocked for the week. Okay, so we need one win. Okay, so we're up against this team, terrible team. If we win this, this is going to be the last Rivals game of this episode. Um, the, the connection's really not great, and to be honest, it's not that enjoyable to, to play when it's like this. So hopefully we can win this game, qualify for the, with the weekly rewards, and yeah, let's get into it. Quite, quite cheesy that I feel like you should have made that tackle, but okay, so just for reference, we are celebrating now. Burba spin. Lovely goal from Trippier. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Skip the celebration, not on purpose. One all that was very nice. I've said it before. I've got Trippy on on my main account, and I play him right middle, so he is fantastic. Mbappe, he is so good. Two one. I keep skipping the celebration by accident. I I actually need to learn how to do some. Like Kada straight through. Let me play, man. Come on, Klaus. Ooh. Joaquin, Joaquin, goal. <sighs> so annoying. Lovely ball from Mbappe. Come on, Jota. No! What? No! <laughs> Lovely ball to Akin. Lovely goal. Okay. Now should be game over. Oh my god, man, this guy just won't stop coming. Stop celebrating. Come on, come on. No, man. Okay, and we eventually get the win. I definitely did not hold the ball for the last five minutes, I promise. I was incredibly wasteful in that game. I will show some of the misses i feel like i want to see the expected goals because i just feel like mine should be expected goals three points i mean that's not actually okay that seemed a lot closer than it was but i should have destroyed him okay so we qualify for the weekly upgrade reward which we are in division eight so it's probably not going to be that great let's have a look we'll probably end up taking the untradables that's perfect we're gonna relist everything else okay last thing we're gonna do because i feel like i do need to upgrade the team just for playing one more game in draft we'll get solskjaer even if we lose but if we win the draft where is it when five foot draft matches we'll get an 81 plus 11 players pack whether we win or lose, I'll also build some 80 plus packs after this, so we'll end off with a little bit of a pack opening. Okay, so we're just making some changes at first. What we're going to do is we're going to bring Acuna on for Gundogan. We're going to switch these two around. And we're going to bring Emre Chan off. We're going to move Foden there, and we are going to put Diaby on the right. I didn't look at his team, to be honest. It really doesn't matter. It tells you nothing about the player so yeah hopefully hopefully we can win that would be ideal but as i said worst case we get soul shot of this i 
and Kunku down the line. Goal. What a goal. Shout out to Shabalala. I thought while I was wearing the yellow, it just reminded me of that. Great ball to DRB, to the bar line, hold that 4 1, GG's. <laughs> His name's Toxic, that was Toxic, it fits. Let's do it again. Okay, but this time. He's going to think I'm going to go down the middle again, which means I'm not. But he might expect that. So we're going to go straight down the middle again. Never mind. Oh, look, Trent made a tackle. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we end up winning 6-5. That was actually a really fun game. Um, I kind of didn't score that last call on purpose. So the game wasn't actually that close. And now we have unlocked Solskjaer and the 81 times 11 pack. So let's get into that. Um, I know Jot is probably better, but this accounts for fun. And I'm obviously a huge Manchester United and Solskjaer fan. And yeah, and the sooner we get all Liverpool players out of the team, the better. Except Van Dijk because he's very good. Swat. Not even a walkout in this pack. Center back. <laughs> Obviously, in an 84 plus, you get an 84. And finally, I'm hoping for at least a walkout in this. A, a promo card or someone usable would be a bonus. And obviously not. English, right back. Couldn't it have at least been Kyle Walker? Okay. Uh, an 83 rated in form isn't bad, actually. Let's check out the team and see where it is. This is what the team's looking like now. Solskjaer up front. We are getting there. It's amazing actually how we only have two gold cards in the team. Okay, so the plan for this week is, depending on work and load shedding, etc. I'm going to try to ground as much rivals as possible. Ground a lot of rivals to make sure that we can qualify for champs next week. Thank you everyone for watching another video. I'm sorry if the lighting's a little bit weird in here. We had fantastic weather in Cape Town this morning up until it got so bleak. Again, if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a comment. Like and subscribe would be much appreciated. It really helps out the channel and I will see you next time.